Hello everyone. Thanks for joining us today. My name is Laura from the Innisfil Idea Lab and Library. In today's Tinkershop tutorial, we are going to learn how to design personalized socks using Cricut Design Space. So let's get started. First, you're going to select the plus sign to open a new project. Next, we're going to select the image icon on the left hand side and this will launch the Cricut search tool and allow us to look for images. Type in the name of the image you'd like to search and click enter or left click on the magnifying glass. On the left hand side we have some filters so we can limit the amount of images we find. I'm going to select cut only for a simpler image. You can scroll down until you find one that you like. We're going to left click and it will appear in our bottom ribbon. Once you've chosen the image you like, select insert images and it will appear in your document. Next, we're going to resize our image. There's two ways we can do this. The first, if you left click on the bottom arrows here and carefully drag, you can make your image larger or smaller. Secondly, you can choose up here under our size toolbar how wide or high you would like your image to be. Next, we're going to add some text. We're going to select the text icon on the left hand side, left click, and a text box will appear. We can type in the words we'd like to, on our socks. On the top left hand corner under font, we can change our font. I'm again going to filter to look for single layer images. You can scroll down until you find a font that you like. And when you select the font, it'll change your text. If you select another text box, it'll use the same font that you just used. If you would like to align your image and your text so they all line up, hold the shift key down while you left click on each piece. Then you can go up to the align button, left click, and click center horizontally. We can now attach these images so they all move together. For the second sock, you can either right click and duplicate your image so you have the same image and font and text on both socks, or you can follow the previous steps by selecting typing in what you're looking for, and selecting the image that you like the most. It appears in your bottom ribbon and insert image. Select the text button on the left hand side to add more text. If you would like your image the same color as your text, just go up to the top left hand corner where the color box is and change the material color. So again, hold down the shift button while we left click on each piece to align and center our project. And then attach on the bottom right hand side.
this point, we're going to save our work by clicking the Save button at the top and name our project. If you have a Cricut at home and are ready to print them, we can click on our top right hand corner, the Make It green button. We want to make sure we mirror the project so the letters don't come out backwards. You click Continue and select your machine. Thank you for joining us for the Cricut Tinker Shop today. Take care.